Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Chams and this is my wife Anissa. You are watching Bez Rules. In today's video we are going to talk about food. The top 5 Tunisian dishes versus the top 5 Bosnian, Bosnian dishes. Stay tuned! Before, before further talk, can you do me a favor by subscribing to the channel and by hitting the like button and leave us a nice comment. This will not cost you anything but this will help us a lot. Stay tuned! Yeah. Let's talk about, about food. The best, the, your favorite thing. <laughs> Mine. <laughs> Mine. <laughs> yes, yeah. I like food. Everyone likes but not likes food. food. Yeah. No way. <laughs> no, everyone likes food. So. Everyone. But to be honest, in today's video, it's not fair. You can't compete like uh, versus the Tunisian food. We are, we have plenty of nice dishes okay. and big variety oh, of food so we sit here to make with and <laughs> make me now to fight <laughs> for me the best food is bosnian oh, oh yeah best. sure yeah and everything from bosnia <laughs> so yeah re really the tunisian food is really rich because it's uh, it combines the mediterranean uh, food the in particular the French, the Italian, the Spanish food, and with the local Tamazir dishes, and along with the Turkish, with the Arabic uh, foods as well. So yeah, the Tunisian cuisine is very very rich, and trust me, there are plenty plenty of nice dishes that you find in Tunisian homes. So this is yeah my my top five list. So my number one on my list is. Cool, cool. Without, without hesitation is the couscous. I know. Yeah, it's very famous, it's very tasty, yeah. it's very special, it's uh, really different than, it's different than the Algerian or the Moroccan couscous that you maybe know. And it's, uh, it's a little bit more spicy, but it's more tasty and uh, yeah. yeah, so you tried couscous. To be honest, it's very good. Yeah, it's, I it's like nice. So much. Yeah. So couscous, uh, there are plenty of ways of preparing couscous and it's vary from uh, city to city in Tunisia and uh, it can be prepared with uh, fish, it can be prepared with uh, chicken, with meat and you can add whatever you want from uh, with uh, of uh, vegetables on the top but it's uh, in every way it's uh, in every way of preparing it it's nice you can't it's make tasty it yeah yeah, it's, you can't go wrong with the really couscous. So it come really highly recommend. If you come in Tunis, you must try the couscous. Yes. Yeah. So yeah, what's your number uh, top one in the list? Number one. Yeah. Chevapi. Chevapi, chevapi, chevapi. the Bosnian chevapi, of course, number one. Yes, the best. Yeah, I tried Bosnian chevapi. It's nice, yeah. And so what is it? What is it? It's grilled meat. Mm -hmm. Meat, mix it, uh, lamb meat and the beef. Beef meat, okay, yeah, mix, mix it together. It, yeah, it's very good. And uh, you eat this with um, salmon. Salmon. It's uh, Bosnian uh, pita bread. Uh huh. Yeah. With the bread, yeah, I try. Yeah, it it was uh, very nice. The bread of. Uh, you cut uh, this bread, put inside this uh, yeah. chavapi, and you uh, add uh, onion. If you yeah. want, if sure, you yeah. want, yeah. it's nice. It's nice. Yeah, it's it's really highly recommended. If you go in Bosnia, you must try the yes. the Bosnian chevapi. Yeah. Everyone will come. Must try. Yes, of course, the number one chevapi. So here we come on uh, my number two on the list, which is the leblebi. Leblebi. Yes, leblebi is my number two on the list. It's very famous Tunisian dish. It's made of, of chickpea and uh, it can uh, be served on the, on the plate and you can add small pieces of uh, bread mm -hmm. with uh, flavored sauce and you can add tuna, you can add uh, of course olive oil and all this is very tasty, it's very easy to make and it's, uh, you can add as well harissa of course 
it's very nice and it can really highly recommend it. There is another way of preparing the leblebi as well. In my city, for example, you can eat, you can uh, try it as a sandwich. If you want to be zerta, for example, you can try the leblebi in a sandwich. It's a little bit different than uh, plate sahfa uh, leblebi, but it's still very, very, very good as well. It's only in Bizert. Uh, only, it? only in Bizert, yeah. It's like speciality of this city. We make. Uh, uh, it's simple food, but it's very, very tasty, and you can find it only in Tunisia. Mm -hmm. nice. So, what's your number two? Number two, sarma. Sarma? You didn't try? No, no. I didn't try this. It's uh, of cabbage leaf. Uh huh. You put on cabbage leaf this meat, rice, onion, mm -hmm. salt, pepper, and you uh -huh. roll that. Uh -huh. I think, uh, yeah, I think it's it's close to some food from the western, I know, from Syria or Lebanon or something like there this. Where at Hainab, I think it's something yeah. close to that. Can be. I will see also this. Yeah, sarma. But maybe there is a different way to prepare it yeah. in Bosnia or to add uh, this, your famous, fa famous uh, vegeta. Vegeta? <laughs> Vegeta, nothing without vegeta. Because you know, in Bosnia, vegeta, if you, if you cook chicken, vegeta, if you cook meat, vegeta, fish, vegeta, coffee, vegeta. Mm, okay, <laughs> if we talk about Tunis, then harissa, harissa, in a, not, harissa not only harissa, we have thousands of flavors, but and harissa, one of them, harissa, 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 harissa the in, in Tunisian food is like the salt, you can't eat food without this uh, risa. Same like without baguette. <laughs> Approximately 10 hours later. So here I come to my top three in my list, uh, which is the most famous, actually, the most uh, famous Tunisian dish, which is the brick. Brick? Yeah, you, oh, I think you tried the brick. I remember brick in the Ramadan. Yeah, every especially in brick. Ramadan every day. We Tunisian make every day brick and yeah. uh, it's a very very easy to make in in 10 minutes maybe you can make it's made of yes. uh, some special pastry called malsuqa and you can and it's fried with eggs and you can add tuna and parsley it's it's very easy to make and it's very very tasty and it come highly highly recommended to try it if you come to Tunisia so you like the, the brick yes i like so much it's very nice and very easy to make in any home that's why yeah. it was very easy to make. <laughs> <laughs> Not only for that, because it's nice as no, well. No, I swear, it's very nice. I like yeah. so much. So, yeah. yeah. So, now your turn, which is now what's the number three? Number three is burek. Burek, of course, burek. the Turkish burek. Turkish burek, Bosnian burek. Uh, how we is talk that? about Bosnian burek. I know from Bo Bo Turkey as well, the burek. No, I don't uh, care. I talk about Bosnian burek. Yeah, I tried the Bosnian burek. It's yeah. nice. It, it's yeah. really nice. Yeah. Yes, you try. So what's inside it? How it's, you mean? It's uh, it's made of flaky pastry and the uh, meat. Uh huh. And yeah. meat. But uh, you made it one time with chicken and with yes. uh, cheese. Yes. And yeah. the cheese is sirnica. So, so it's uh, I guess I think it's the same. No, I saw you same pastry. You put uh, one time meat and no, one time no, cheese. No. So what's Bu the difference? Burek is burek. Don't make. Uh, <laughs> what burek is burek? If one Bosnian hear you, that you say. Yeah. Burek is pita. Finish. I, I trust me, it's the same. <laughs> In in every way, anyway, it's nice. I try yeah. to, I try as well the burek in Turkey, but I still prefer the Bosnian burek. You try in Bosnia burek. You try mine burek. Yeah. Huh? You are Bosnian, no? Yes, I'm it's Bosnian. It's the same. Yeah, but it's, uh, which better? Of course, yours. Uh, you know, still want to get? It's, of course, yours is better. <laughs> uh, so here we come to my number four on uh, the list. Uh, my number four on the list is the. Tajin. Tajin? Yes, the tajin is the Tunisian version of the frittata or of the Mexican uh, tortilla. It's very easy to make, it's very tasty. There are plenty of ways of making the, the tajin in Tunis. You can make tajin malsoqa as well from the same pastry than the brick, previously said. You can make it with potato, you can make it... Uh, yeah, there are plenty, plenty of ways of making the brick, but all the... Uh, of making the tagine, sorry. But all the ways are very, very tasty and come highly recommended. But it's generally, it's made of uh, beaten eggs with... Uh, 
grated cheese with meat and various vegetables uh, and it's baked like a big cake and it's really easy to make you can make uh, tagine in 20 minutes maybe 15 20 minutes like this you can, you can just mix the things and uh, it's easy to make and it's very tasty trust me it's very tasty yeah so we can make this sometimes yeah i will show you how <laughs> <laughs> you were you was try so tell us how is it you was try it it's good you was try it in tunis at my house yeah it's very good but uh, still uh, couscous and the brick is it's different it's different for you yeah. Yeah. Um, some people will prefer more uh, yeah mm -hmm. my number four yes you're something sweet no. something sweet yes yeah. baklava baklava the bosnian yeah. baklava yeah i know this we have also baklava in tunisian food we it's like turkish yeah. baklava yeah i think uh, everywhere baklava is yeah same so you could not find some more special Bosnian. <laughs> it's little. I tried baklava in Bosnia. It's a little bit different than the Turkish baklava. It's uh, it's bigger in size, and the taste is a little bit different. And I think in Bosnia it's thinner than the Turkish and, or the Tunisian baklava. No, you can make how much. Uh -huh, so yeah, it's Inside. it's the same anyway. So baklava is baklava. <laughs> yeah. And here we come to my number five on the list, which is shakshuka, the Tunisian shakshuka or ajja. Yeah, shakshuka or ajja. Yeah, it's uh, very easy to make. It's very tasty. You can make it. You can try eat it on the morning at the breakfast. You can eat it in the lunch, and you can eat it anytime. It's a Tunisian dish made of tomato, pepper, spices. Uh, and eggs, you can add the Tunisian merguez, which is the Tunisian hot dog, but it's, uh, trust me, it's way, way better than Tunisian, uh, than the hot dog that you know. And uh, yeah, that's it. You can cut it in small pieces and put in the ajja or the chakshuka, and it's very, very nice. Very, very tasty, very, very easy. I said I'll become hungry. <laughs> I said. <laughs> but you try ajja or no? No, and, yeah, it's very nice. It's very easy to make. Maybe five minutes you can make uh, chakshuka. Yeah, and it's uh, actually the chakshuka is uh, it's, it's popular through the North African countries. So there are probably some other ways to doing it in uh, North African countries as well. So yeah, this is my list. Which is what? Uh, what's your number five? In the number list? five. Let's put one chorba. Chorba. Yes, begova chorba. Begova chorba. Yes. Mm. It's slow cooked chicken and the vegetables. Mm -hmm. It's very good. Cream, I... like cream. Uh -huh. I did. Yeah, this is the white chorba that you make. It close, yeah. Yeah, yeah. it's nice. It's it's nice. Yeah, it reminds me. It's I think it's also it's like white chorba. It's, yeah, yeah. Uh, but it's nice. It, trust me, it's very tasty. Cream white yeah. chorba. Yeah. Yeah, it's nice and tasty. So yeah, thank you. I think uh, this is. Uh, I think I mean that. <laughs> Actually, it's not fair to put only five Tunisian dishes because you know there are plenty, plenty, plenty of Tunisian food, and it's very hard to choose the top five. It was very hard for oh, me to choose the top, the top five. I will add fast. You can try as well the nochia. It's different than the Western nochia. You can try the kafteji, the Tunisian kafteji, it's very nice. You can try the Tunisian salad. You can try the slata the Tunisian, uh, the mishwiya salad, mishwiya, we call it slata mishwiya. It's very nice as well. Oof, mm -hmm. lot of, Talk lot more. of. Uh, Talk, I talk, can't talk, talk until talk. tomorrow and will not I finish. I become hungry here, <laughs> no stop <talk. laughs> It was unfair to compete versus Bosnia, you know, so we, it's clear we know who is the winner in these things. Yeah, yeah. Sure, sure. So, okay guys, thank you for watching. I hopefully you enjoyed our video. Please like if you enjoy, please like if you do. And please subscribe. Kindly consider subscribing to the channel. It will not cost you anything, but it will help us a lot. In See you in the next video. video. Goodbye. Ciao. See you. Ciao. Bye. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm.